You know, one of the biggest memory of mine was coming from a foreign country um, to a cafeteria and being faced with a corn dog, which I had no idea what that was. And um, just to be able to now be the one to create the menu, it's such a full circle moment for me. That's like really satisfying. So. Aaron Smith, Director of Nutrition Services, aka Chef Claus. Uh, today we're bringing some extra holiday cheer to families and kids uh, here at Denny International. Uh, these are tough times, so whatever we can do to help spread the joy of the holiday season and give them a little bit of a relief. Hi, my name is Emmy Collins. I'm the district chef for Seattle Public Schools, and we're here at Denny International Middle School um, where we're, you know, serving up some delicious meals, including one week meal boxes, some toys for the children of the community. Ever since the pandemic hit, we have been like pivoting and adjusting. And one of those um, adjustments that we had to make is how to continue this essential service during school breaks where there's no school and there's traditionally our program is closed. We have decided to open 16 sites. We'll be opening those sites one day a week. And in partnership with the city of Seattle, we'll be providing one week meal boxes to families in our community, as well as uh, fresh fruit and vegetable produce boxes that they can take along with them. So the boxes that we're building here at Denny, um, in combination with what we're building at the Central Kitchen, is going out over the holiday break for our Amazon home delivery. Uh, this year we need to go above and beyond what's normal. So here at Denny, they build in 4,000 boxes to go for those students. We're doing this for the first time ever at our John Stanford Center. We'll be doing a pop-up drive through where families will have one more chance to get that one week meal box, as well as a hot, delicious turkey holiday meal that was cooked from scratch from that central kitchen, um, as well as in partnership with Trophy Cupcakes, who generously donated some holiday themed cupcakes. They'll be able to pick up some sweet treats as well. What we're hoping is that we can help bridge that gap a little bit and give them some relief and uh, joy and I think that Chef Emmy has put together a great box uh, for, for the families for this holiday season. And we've got Mrs. Santa Claus and Chef Claus over here with an example of the one week meals that will, will be available for families to pick up. We have a chicken, cranberry chicken salad that you can build. We have some buttermilk biscuits that'll be like a breakfast sandwich that you can build some roasted veggies, some fresh produce in here, yogurt, parfait that families can build themselves. So we've got a lot of goodies. I really feel like it's a win-win situation for all of us. You know, the families are able to get the essential things that they need. I'm a mother, I have three young children, so I know the importance of the nutritious, delicious food. And our staff is super um, passionate about being able to serve the community and help out during these tough times. <laughs> It's not about us. It's, it's, it's about the need and it's about the community. It's about supporting families um, and supporting the students, uh, SPS students. And so as long as there is a need and as long as they need that support, we're here to be their support system.